Well, for more than 30 years, the American Cancer Society's Making Strides Against Breast Cancer Walks have united communities in the nation's largest movement to end breast cancer as we know it for everyone. This year in South Florida, Making Strides Against Breast Cancer will provide a supportive community for breast cancer survivors, metastatic breast cancer thrivers, caregivers, supporters, and families alike. For this week's WSFL-TV Demesman and Dover Doing Good campaign, Michelle Friedman, breast cancer survivor and Making Strides Against Breast Cancer volunteer, and Kim Price, co-chair of Making Strides Against Breast Cancer at Broward, join ISF to share more about this initiative and how you can become a part of their community and keep the help going. Take a look. Both of you, welcome to the show. Wonderful to hey. be here. Hi. October Breast Cancer Awareness Month, a beautiful month, celebratory, but we're also making sure we shine a light on stories of women warriors. As you said, Michelle, earlier off camera, we were talking of survivors and also that community of people helping those survivors thrive. Tell us about your experience and your journey through breast cancer and your diagnosis. Um, I was diagnosed through a routine mammogram. It was actually my first mammogram. So how long, how long ago was that? So eight years ago. So how they say mammograms save lives. I am truly a believer. Um, my doctor called me and no one ever wants to hear the words, you have cancer. When you got that call, and for our audience, because I think, let's talk about it all. Yeah. The first thought. Um, oh my God, I'm gonna die. Like, and or what's gonna happen? I'm gonna have surgery. I'm gonna, like, my life is over. Just fear, just like you, your brain did not even know how to process all of it. How do you feel now? Now I feel really strong and I'm so grateful. Like my story is actually a happy story. Um, I did surgery, chemo and radiation and just had a wonderful support team with friends and family, a um, wonderful care team who just got me through it. And yeah, I, I did it. Well, we're glad you're here. That's a tell the story today, you. Michelle, absolutely. Now you're one of the top fundraisers for the Making Strides Walk in Broward. Why is that so important to you? Um, the first year I was diagnosed, I went to um, the Broward Walk, the Making Strides Walk, and I was in the middle of my chemo treatments. I was really weak. I actually was not able to walk. Went to the survivor booth, but Making Strides has a really nice um, program for the survivors, and just sat there and talked to other survivors, and I realized, like, I'm not alone. We're all in this together. Kim, welcome to the show. Glad to have you here as well. So the American Cancer Society is hosting two awesome walks this year at two great locations. One is new. Yes. Tell me about it, Boo. Yeah, so we have two locations um, offered to the South Florida community this year. And to Michelle's point, you know, these walks offer a community of support to breast cancer survivors, to metastatic thrivers, uh, support family, all alike, and with one common goal to fight breast cancer. And our first walk will be going down Saturday, October 21st. Mm -hmm. And our second walk will go down Saturday, October 28th at the Lone Depot Park in Miami, home of the Marlins. Come out to both events this month in support of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Michelle, like I said, honored, glad, and so happy you're still yes. here with us to tell the story today. Kim, thank you for the work that you do and for, and for heeding that call and for being an exemplary woman and being of that community. It's important. You both are stars. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Make sure you show your support this weekend at FLA Live Arena.